Offset has spent over a decade rising to the status of multi-million dollar rapper and trap star. He was born Kiari Kendra Cephas in Lawrenceville, Georgia, and became a member of the Migos back in 2009, which later became one of the most successful hip-hop groups in music history. With an incredibly successful career both as a solo artist and as part of the popular group, Offset shows no signs of slowing down in the department of stacking up racks and now has a net worth of around $26 million. The hip-hop artist is far from modest when it comes to the items that success can buy, and apart from catchy bars and fun hooks, Offset is known for his extravagant lifestyle, which includes a gigantic custom Ford four-door monster truck, a jewelry collection worth more than $3 million, and a modern mansion in Buckhead, Atlanta. Luxury is one thing that this rapper doesn't compromise on, and as someone who came from very humble beginnings, who can blame him? Wondering what else Offset spends his hard-earned money on? Well then, we've got you covered. Here's an exclusive inside look at the $26 million lifestyle of Offset. Offset grew up with his cousin Quavo and Quavo's nephew, Takeoff. All three of them were taken care of by Quavo's mother, and spend most of their time in her small house. Today, the three Migos are renowned for their distinctive triplet rhyming style and bass-heavy beats that, at the very least, will make you bob your head a little. But before all of this recognition, they were just three guys in a bando, trying to make some money from a drug operation to buy recording equipment and clothes so they could look like actual rappers. The Migos formed in 2009 and dropped their first mixtape, Jug Season, in August 2011. But it was only in 2012 when their song Bando became a local hit that they caught the attention of Zaytoven, an Atlanta producer and collaborator with Gucci Mane. Zaytoven began to work with Migos and introduced them to Kevin Coach K. Lee, who soon became their manager. Their real breakout moment was in 2013 when Drake did a verse on a remix of their song, Versace, which put them on the Billboard Hot 100 for the first time, even if that was at number 99. Even the fashion label itself took notice and ended up playing the song to close the Versace show at Milan Fashion Week. In 2015, Migos released their debut studio album, Young Rich Nation. The album was incredibly successful and peaked at number one on the Billboard 200 chart. At this point, Migos was already making about $40,000 for each show. But that same year, Offset was arrested, along with Quavo and rapper Rich the Kid, on weapon and drug charges. Quavo and Rich the Kid were let off with fines and community service. But Offset, who already had a criminal record, got an eight-month jail sentence. But once Offset has served his time, Migos came back strong with Bad and Bougie in 2016. The song became a viral pop culture sensation, and with the shout out from Donald Glover at the Golden Globe Awards, it skyrocketed to the very top of the Billboard Hot 100. In 2017, Migos released their second studio album, Culture, which was later certified platinum. The album features guest appearances from DJ Khaled, Lil Uzi Vert, Gucci Mane, 2 Chainz, and Travis Scott while the production was handled by Metro Boomin and Murder Beats, among others. At this point, the Migos had definitely made a solid name for themselves. In the same year that Culture was dropped, Offset joined 21 Savage and Metro Boomin to release the album Without Warning, which reached number one on the US rap charts and number four on the Billboard 200 chart. Between September 2018 and September 2019, Migos earned an estimated $36 million, then, in 2019, Offset dropped his debut studio album, Father of Four, under Motown and Quality Control Music, making him the final member of Migos to release a solo album. Father of Four debuted at number four on the Billboard 200 and gave fans popular hits like Red Room and Clout, featuring his now ex-wife, Cardi B. So, how exactly is Offset making the kind of money that buys him luxury cars, a mansion in Atlanta, and jewelry worth millions? To begin with, the cost of booking Migos for a show is between $250,000 and $350,000. Based on that, it's not hard to imagine how Offset could be making around $100,000 for each show he does with the group. In addition to that, 
the cost of booking offset for a solo act is $100,000. Then there are streams. Migos has over 18 million monthly listeners on Spotify, about 9 million on Apple Music, and about 18 million monthly views on YouTube. That means monthly, the group is making roughly $72,000 from Spotify, $45,000 from Apple Music, and $54,000 from YouTube, bringing their monthly streaming earnings to an estimated total of $171,000. And as a solo artist, Offset makes around $40,000 on Spotify, $25,000 through Apple Music, and over $8,400 through YouTube. His total monthly earnings, if he does two solo shows, one show with Migos, and maintains all his streaming success, would be over $373,000. In addition to that, it's reported that Migos also makes a chunk of cash from merch sales. So best believe Offset's bank account is looking healthy as he makes more than $4.4 million a year, $86,000 a week, and $12,300 a day. Offset also recently launched a high-end fashion line in Paris this year as well as invested in the popular gaming organization FaZe Clan, which is likely going to add to his enviable streams of income in the near future. With that kind of money, Offset can afford to live like a king, and he does, in a $5.8 million Atlanta mansion that he and Cardi B bought last year. The 22,500 square foot mansion is in Buckhead, Atlanta, and sits on roughly seven acres. This modern home features classic details like stone pillars and a large staircase, as well as five bedrooms, seven bathrooms, four half baths, a wine cellar, a wet bar, a games room, a shooting range, and a his and hers dressing room with ample space for Offset's pricey clothing collection. The backyard also features an infinity pool and various fountains surrounded by super neat hedgerows. When Offset isn't in his multi-million dollar home, he's on the move in either a Porsche, a Bentley, a McLaren, or a Ford. These are only some of the cars he calls his own. And it's also reported that he has a special garage for all of his old school cars. The 2014 Porsche 911 Carrera is one of Offset's favorites, with a retail price between $97,000 and $110,000. Offset also famously carried $20,000 in cash to buy a Bentley SUV after an appearance on The Ellen DeGeneres Show. His Bentayga features a sophisticated red interior. Then there's Offset's super exotic orange McLaren 720S, which starts at a hefty $275,000 and has a 4.0 liter twin turbocharged V8 engine and over 700 horsepower. Next in Offset's crazy car collection is the monstrous Ford F-150 Raptor truck, which he wrapped in an army green color that strangely complements its bright orange interior and the stars on its ceiling. In an Instagram video that shows off some of Offset's prized vehicles, Cardi B mentions that he keeps a wider collection elsewhere. He's known to have a Lamborghini, a Pontiac, and a Maybach, amongst others. One of his cars, a Dodge Challenger, was completely wrecked in a car accident in 2018. But it's what Offset did for a stranger afterwards that shows that he doesn't just limit himself to buying his own cars. The rapper shared a video of himself giving a man a brand new car, which appears to be a Nissan Altima. According to Offset, the man had saved his life on the day of the accident by helping him out of his car and with getting to the hospital. Offset spent days tracking the man down after his recovery. And in true hip-hop fashion, Offset doesn't play games when it comes to his chains and what he calls grown man watches. He even has a pair of diamond-rimmed Cartier glasses that cost $18,000. Altogether, the Trap Star's insane jewelry collection is worth over $3 million. In a GQ segment, Offset shows off his raindrop chain made by Eliante. The back of the raindrop-shaped pendant is engraved with the words Drop Top, making an iced-out reference to Bad and Bougie. Offset casually dropped $100,000 for the piece, which features a staggering 65 diamond carats. Another one of Offset's prized pieces is his drip chain. The pendant alone set him back $60,000 and is covered in diamonds in the shape of his name. 
Offset also has a cross pendant worth $220,000, a baguette chain worth $45,000, and a $170,000 Richard Millet watch. And let's not forget his impressive selection of rings, ranging from $20,000 to $60,000. One of them is a $30,000 star-shaped ring with dazzling baguette cut diamonds, but it pales in comparison to the $60,000 ring that features a massive carrot and a half baguette diamond in the center. Offset is extremely proud of his jewelry and sees it as a tangible result of his success. He's also not a big fan of any medals showing off his pieces and prefers each one completely covered in diamonds. But some of the most expensive pieces of jewelry that Offset bought weren't even for himself. In 2017, he proposed to Cardi B with a $550,000 engagement ring. The custom-made ring features an 8-carat stone surrounded by two half-carat pair diamonds and two carats worth of pink and white stones. The ring took a month and a half to make and was commissioned to pristine jewelers in New York City. Offset was soon to prove that that was clearly not big enough when he worked with Pristine Jewelers again to get Cardi B a $1 million diamond ring for her 27th birthday in 2019. The heart-shaped diamond called the Titanic, because of its ridiculous size, came with an interlocking matching band. If the name of the center diamond doesn't give you an idea of how massive it is, then the fact that it's 20 carats should. And the surrounding diamonds in the band are an impressive 25 carats on their own. With a penchant for adorning his ex-wife in diamonds and a $30 million collection of his own, Offset has shown that he can truly drip the hardest. For him, an impressive range of cars, real estate, and jewelry is simply a part of the culture and seems to genuinely make him happy. Migos is set to release Culture 3 in 2020, which means more opportunity for the trio to keep our heads bobbing, but also to make an obscene amount of money. Well, there you have it, the entire $26 million lifestyle of Offset in a single YouTube video. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and if you did, please hit that like button. That's all I have for today. I'm out.